Hello, and welcome back to some more Total Double Focus. On our last episode, we mostly did a bunch of side quests, and it just shows how much of a dingus I am as far as getting the Hagatas. She said candy in the desert, right? I was trying to turn her nose this entire time. I have a feeling a few people were like, just try and go tell where your mom is at. Oh, and then I was like, wait a moment, I'm gonna try that because it's like. I tried off screen. I didn't pick up the item yet. I didn't pick up the item yet. Don't, don't worry. I just wanted to see if I could go down there because I was thinking, Candy Desert. Candy Desert. It's not an in between area. It's just that one particular area. Because there's sand pits too. Oh, I don't want to get hit by that. You little ant lion. Because look, you can just literally just do this. There you go. My gosh. Because it was literally there if you look at the map too. Oh, I can't believe I was so confused there. I really can't believe it. Anyway, we got the Pagata, so we have to head back to Showa. So I guess I'll see you lot there in a bit with an edit, because else it's just going to be boring uh, watching me go there for the umpteenth time. Alright, we are back at Showa with our Pagata in hand. Let's just actually have a brief reading of the item description before we do it. Although it's owned by Showa Tormar, she usually doesn't know where it is. Anyway, hello Showa. Ow, oh, my Pagata. Okay, to deliver it? Thank you, it may not be worthy as reward, but please take this. Mysterious parcel. Thank you very much, I'm so blessed. Now I won't have to get scolded by Nazrin. Uh, by the way, where are we? <laughs> Thank you very so much, I'm blessed. Now I won't have to get out okay. of okay. like, Right, so now I'm gonna see you all soon enough at, um, Komachi. Yeah, Komachi, that's her name, totally. Yep, 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 I totally didn't almost forget for a brief. But yeah, back at the waterway for me. Alright, we are back at Komachi, now it's time to deliver the parcel. Oh, looks like you have something good. <laughs> how about this? Appearances can be deceiving. I wonder if it's good enough. Money is the key that can open doors or something. Okay. Girls, yeah, I'll get you two to the other side. Okay. Thank you kindly. And if you want to get there, don't talk. I'll work as much as I received. So, what is this going to be about? I wonder. Boss room, that's what. Oh, Nelly. It's gonna be Kokoro. There's no way it isn't with the basing off the statues and the masks and whatnot. Now I did change up my setup um, because I know that there is a lot of ways you can probably better improve yourself in this game. Um, for one, being able to play both characters relatively effectively would probably be a significant improvement over just simply playing Momiji, I'm aware. Um, but secondly, Having a setup based on defensive stuff, I think, would be pretty good. Like, for example, I can Helmet Splitter, I can then roll up, slice a bunch. I need to get rid of Lie Down, actually, because I was just forgetting through. Um, but you get the picture. I think I'll get something stamina related to anything. So then I can, you know, do more attacks. Now, I have chased up Wolf Claws, and it's pretty good, but it's only good if they stay in one spot for a while. I should just make sure that's easy for to hear that does. Um, we also have this setup for healing, of course, so let's see how this goes. I'm really worried, man. Still, it's beautiful here. I've never seen a place of warfling threat. Well, that's because there aren't many places in, oh, any places in Kentucky that face the sea. Sea? What's that? Oh, you don't know, Mamiji? It's like a body of water that changes volume depending on the day or time. Which reminds me, I heard that the moon also has a sea. What well, if it's the same one? The volume of water changes? How mysterious. Yes, it's mysterious and strange indeed. Ah, you scared me. Once feelings are like waves. Like how a storm settles, they get wicked people push though. Huh? I'll add about my emotions from this place. This here reflects one's feelings. Now I will show you the flowing water and the trembling heart. Okay, Kokoro. Um, she's saying something poetic, but I think she just wants to test out her new power. Art then dance and now poetry. Fine, then I'll teach you. The Moon Moon Mara News Mirror does not need a designated poetry column. And there's no sea in Kitsogio! <laughs> Oh gosh, 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 okay, right, so. I probably should swap in. So. Nice part. Okay, we need to actually start hanging with them. Oh, we did, did we get hit? Yeah, we did get hit. You gonna charge us again? Is this all you did? Or do you actually do projectiles? Oh gosh, I don't want to knock, get knocked into the water right now. <laughs> oh gosh, yeah, you do projectiles. Okay. Oh gosh, okay. There we go. Okay, right, so just gotta take it easy.
Go to stay topped up just in case if there's a way for me to push it out. Oh gosh! Ah! She's gonna knock me off! Oh thank you, Bolt! Thank you, Fairy! You saved me! You saved me indeed! Are you gonna come over here? Oh, not quite. That takes a ton of stamina. Holy moly. Oh. Take all the coach now, just as probably just against because we did notice that she does a lot of damage if she hits us and also the moves are moly hat. Well, let's go! Let's go right now! I got this! I hope so anyway. Uh, uh. Ah! Okay, not quite, not quite, not quite. Okay, do this real quick. Ow, my face. Okay. Oh. oh gosh! No! That took so much health! Oh. Oh, okay. That was not the right setup. Let's take that hat, but it's fine. Not the right setup again. Thankfully we have revenge, so we get stamina back. That's why I figured. If we fight, because sometimes we get hit multiple times in bosses, so I was thinking revenge would be pretty good. Oh okay. god. That was cheap, and you know it. Right, come on, we need to go in the aggressive now. One more hat, and that should be good. Good car up. Come here! Back! Back! There we go. <laughs> Men rake you drifts on war. I was defeated. Ah, that's what it means to be a journalist. <laughs> the big pointy nose! Being a journalist, I have more faces than even you. You liar. Twitch. Many faces. Oh, does that interest you? Do you have an interest in reporting? I do. Good, then you could shadow me as my new assistant. I can be your teacher! <laughs> but I decline. Ah, you put me up just to break me down? From the sea, I was able to attain calmness in my heart. That's good enough. Uh, enough for me. Oh, it's that Luigi thing is so cute. Oh. And here's the mask from my experience. What, you're giving it to us? I should say what we could get, but how I'm saying, I thought I was going to get another assistant. Received Kokoro's mask. And we're stuck here. Before you covered a considerable amount of this world, Castle area, desert area, fairytale area, and now water city area. Why hasn't, so why isn't it yielded anything? Oh? Is something wrong? I don't mean our entire adventure in my bullet pad, but it seems like I left it at the base. Oh, we've got Riffy here in this world, so it maybe it's best to go back at, uh, to Kosa soon. <laughs> oh, well, I guess I'll have to run back to the bank because I don't want to waste the portal, but just in case, you know? That, that was satisfying though. I, I, I'm glad that I did much better in that boss fight compared to the other ones that I've done, you know? Oh, oh. Okay, yada yada. Time to head back. Oh man, oh man, oh man, right. Let's just. I should probably just have a. No, we'll just get an easy breathing for now. I like the setup, I do, because um, even a wolf claw is pretty good. If, you know, the thing stands still and you get the free time to do so. Um, I just prefer um, the robe one, like the starting one, because it costs like no stamina. It's consistent, and it's got the, you know, Castlevania swing to it, I guess? That's why I've been using it this entire time. Actually, since we got that mask and we didn't get any skill from Kokoro, do you think this works on Kagero? Let's see, let's see, let's see. This is before we head back to base, because I actually just realized, yeah, we could probably just get a few more things done. Poor Wakasagi, being left here for so long. And it's too late! I'm gonna get him! Gah! Well, Meiji, that mask that we got from Kokoro. Yeah, there we go, because that's a calming effect. Right. The mask is shining and glowing. This will calm her down a bit. Oh, secret technique. Shining mask. <gasps> mask, mask, mask. What is that light? Did we do it? Shwoom. Chrono Sage. Wolf. Well, you saved me. Yeah, yeah. As a reward, I'll assist you. Please call me if you run into trouble. So we got Aquapilla! Because since we didn't get anything from... Wait, since we have Wacky Sagi, does that mean that we can go to Journal? That's the point too. You know, what does Kagero have to say? 
Dakota Sage World. What does that even mean? <laughs> I don't know! I don't know! So who's that for? Uh, let me see, is it for Luigi's? I mean, she's... No, of course not. It's probably for you. Uh, let's see. Yep. Wait, what does it say? Princess Waikasagi generates a column of water. It could be used as both a scaffold and a shield against enemy dead Mercury attacks. Okay, so let's see what this is about. Whoa. Wait. That is extremely useful. And I can assume as to why they didn't give you that in the first place. Until pretty much the end of the game as, as a result. It's because, hey... Oh, nice things. Okay, we're just gonna walk back to journal here. I guess. Not the only reason to edit out here. Because it's not even that long ways away. No, it's not that far. We could get a break with them. We just get point. And we're pretty much back up to journal. Okay, so let's talk to her. I don't know if we have to use the power on her, but let's find out. Yeah. Water? And it's not just a little or a few, but all of it. Gulp, gulp. Ah, I'm alive. Of all places, why is it nice for you like you here? Um, well, I was, when I was playing in World of War, I found a book. Right when I looked inside, I found myself in the sea. Even I was no match for it. Or actually, even the sea was no match for me. Ha, ha, ha. How convenient. All right, pick this up. Take as a token of my fangs. As a skill, Eye of the Beast. Or Eyes of the Beast, sorry. All right, so let's see what we got, what we got, what we got, what we got. Um, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, so... I oh, should probably not re reading that thing here. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Eyes of the Beast. That's pretty much useless! Thanks, Cherno! Thanks. You truly are the strongest for a reason. Anyway, we're gonna be doing one more edit because this is actually gonna be past me. Because I pretty much want to do this back to front. Um, just so then we get the ending point at, well, the true ending point. It's just that I noticed that in the next episode we needed a certain way to get out. Or elevate ourselves. Let's just put it that way because else we would have been at a dead end. So I'll see you guys in a bit with past me. All right, we are back at home base. Huh? What, what, what is this awful sight? Where are Kozasu and Kasume? Aye, please look at the top of the desk. The ominous portal has come from my bullet pad, which has transformed into a magical book. Then that means your bullet pad has caused this whole catastrophe. More importantly, does that mean it sucked in Kozasu and Kasume? It seems so. Whenever I open a book in this world, I never get sucked into it. But this magical power is this awful sight. So this is also the power of Book King. To go within a world of the book world. This is double book king! That's not time to be saying such gibberish. If they're trapped in there, we have to hurry and go rescue Kozasu and everyone else. Right, as long as we can defeat my bullet pad, we should be able to resolve this situation. Mummy, this will be our last coverage. Bring it on! Oh, man. Yeah, so we're, we're saving? Okay, so this is probably the shortest episode for Total Double Focus, but next time we shall tackle on. What seems to be the final boss of this game. Yes, there are plenty of side things that we could have done, but that's just part of the Metroid video way. We managed to complete a large amount of you consider like our map exploration and whatnot. 84%, 73% items. It's pretty, it's pretty good. Pretty good. We can always get the other ones later, maybe assuming that we can still reload the save. Who knows? Who knows indeed. But anyway, folks, I'll see you all next time for another scoop. So, ta-ta for now.